Welcome back to my channel. Did you know that a sea cucumber is a rich source of chondroitin sulfate? It is good for arthritis. It is also considered a delicacy in Asian countries. It is also used for a traditional Chinese soups to treat fatigue, impotence, constipation, frequent urination, and joint pains. With a combination of our vegetable here, I am using a broccoli which is rich in fiber and protein. So for our recipe for today, I am cooking a braised sea cucumber with abalone. For our ingredients, I have here a frozen curry fish or sea cucumber. It is from Honduras. Actually, there's a lot of types of sea cucumber. For now, I am using a curry fish sea cucumber which possesses the best quality among others. Its color is like brownish or yellowish brown. We also have here our dried mushrooms, rock sugar, canned abalone, fresh broccoli, shallots, garlic, ginger, oyster sauce, cooking oil, salt, cooking wine, light soy sauce, dark soy sauce, and pepper. Let's start by soaking our mushrooms into the hot water for around 3 hours. After 3 hours, we're just going to remove our mushroom from the water we're going to cut it and we're just going to leave the waters because we're going to use it later here's my sea cucumber i already sliced it into pieces now let's turn on the fire and heat up our pan let's add some oil and saute our garlic, ginger, and shallots. Let's just mix it well until we can get the aromatic flavor from the spices. Now, let's add in our sliced mushrooms. We're just going to mix it well and saute for a while. And then, we're going to add in the water from the soaked mushrooms. And then, let's transfer it into the pot. Let it simmer for at least one hour. Remember to check it once in a while to avoid burning. Then add in the remaining ingredients. 
after an hour, we are going to add in our sea cucumber. Mix it well and let it simmer for at least 15 minutes. Meanwhile, I am boiling water in the pan with ginger, salt, and cooking oil just to blanch our broccoli. After blanching our broccoli, we're just going to remove it from the pan and place it into the strainer. Now I am opening our canned abalone. I'll just place it into the pot and boil for just 2 minutes. Now it's boiling already, so we're just going to turn it off and get it ready. Now, let's arrange our broccoli into the serving plate, just to make sure that we have a good presentation. Now, let's pour in our braised sea cucumber and mushrooms and then let's decorate the abalone on top let's just arrange it very well on top to make it more presentable Now, here's my braised sea cucumbers with abalone ready to serve. Thanks for watching everyone. And please don't forget to subscribe. Thank you.